there will be hoping as a parent of a missing child that they find no evidence of Catrice at this vicinity. This year, Richard Lee's original belief that his daughter was kidnapped in 1981 finally became the focus of the investigation into her disappearance. A search of this German riverbank close to where she vanished found no trace, casting real doubt on the old police theory that she'd either drowned or had been murdered. It's been probably the most important year on the case for Catrice. It's taken me 36 years to get the correct information out in the public domain. It went as far as New Zealand and Australia, so I'm, I'm getting there. I'm not there, Rachel, not quite yet. Um, I want it global. Do you feel you made the absolute most of that opportunity? Because it was a long time coming and you seemed to grab it with both hands. It put it in a nutshell, Rachel. I had to take the opportunity. Um, this was the stepping stone, the springboard to get my um, story out there, to get Catrice's story out there. Were you surprised at the time about the amount of coverage you got or were you expecting it to be that big? Um, no, I was totally taken aback. Um, I didn't realise how much people cared. Mm. And um, that means a great deal to you? Yeah. And I'm overwhelmed. It's given Mr Lee fresh momentum, determined to reach the truth. I've had a barrister um, on behalf of Catrice's case. The investigations are at a very sensitive stage. There are no Christmas decorations in Mr Lee's home. It's a choice he makes every year. This will be the 37th Christmas without yeah. Catrice. How do you deal with Christmas time without her? Um, I made a promise and I said that I would not um, celebrate Christmas until I have Catrice sat at the table with the rest of my family and I spend Christmas alone and I reflect on what I can do in the future, what I've achieved in the past and this year, as far as I'm concerned, has been a fantastic year, um, fantastic coverage by the media and how do I top it next year? And that's my big dilemma. Richard Lee, thank you very much for speaking to us and thank best you. wishes for the new year.